spin options of Zampa and Agar? I would if I was Vera Coley because um, SSI and Manish Pandey, there's a, a concern there, um, whereas we know Jadeja, he, he can hit boundaries. I consider him up the order. Sanjay Mandraker. Straight away off the mark, he'll get a couple of runs. It's always good to get off the mark of the first. Identical uh, shots, similar results as well. Oh. Well, the question will. Oh. I think the difficult. He's always been very good with his line, Pat Cummins, when Stark and him stance up a little bit, as it does to left arm seat. And the umpire may have just decided this is more an umpire score of missing the stumps. Brilliant delivery, 147 kilometers per hour. You can see that just a bit too much swing in the end. Young Goff, the umpire making the right call. They did. Now that's the line he was searching for. That didn't swing much. He wants that to come back in. Yeah, that's good bowling, really good bowling. I think what cost Mitchell Stark in the end it was not only that on the LBW decision it not only swung but have a look right now boom there was quite a lot of lateral movement which is what you were talking about in the Indian innings as well I'll give you the best advice that's lethal well played saw the gap as well not the one we were talking about but this time he saw the width and went after it five runs of that over ten for no wicket what otherwise would have been a brilliant over it would have been a dot fall over off the bat there was a wide then he bowls uh, a delivery outside the off stump once again with for old Sermine, once again it's a boundary how magnificent is this this is glorious batting goes about his cricket it wasn't a great ball width is not the answer on this wicket but just such magnificent hands, free flowing. And yeah, that's hurting. Scooped. They've just landed on the cushion. They're just over. Again, short and wide from Mitchell Stark. And again, it's all hands from Roy Sharma. To reach for that delivery, see that, he had to reach for it. Stark was looking back uh, at his uh, landing position, maybe he had a bit of a problem. Maybe. Now, well bowled, well bowled. Maybe just a bit of bat, then onto the pads. Oh, just falling short. Missing leg. A lot of innings at number five. Steve Smith did it in the afternoon. Roy Sharma repeats that in the twilight. It's 38 for no wicket with that six. The overs so far. Not a bad delivery. But this is a wonderful shot. Nothing wrong with the delivery, you'd say. It's just that the genius of Rohit Sharma has got the ball to sail over the boundary. Huge, huge totals in limited over cricket. Once he... Well played. He showed this in the last game as well, how he's always eyeing that gap on the leg side. Rohit Sharma that you see today, the one that we saw in the archives is different. This is the Rohit Sharma who picks the gaps in the field. And it's not really easy for him to play these shots on the onside because he's one of those rare batsmen, modern batsmen, whose front foot is pointing. And that's what you look injury. Oh, lovely. Now you've had one here.
And that'll be fine as well. There's a man at the boundary at third man. He can never be that fine. Two sixes. And the speed as well. 143 clicks and with provided flashed hard. Now that's easy for him. Doesn't get a run. Oh, it's that threading a needle. That is whether intentional or not, he's found the gap as perfectly as is possible. The field is in that area. Cross seam delivery. Might have been the cutter as well. Just opening the face and guiding it through the tiny gap. Class act, isn't he? He's such a fine one day player. Got himself going in test cricket now, but he. This time there's a fielder right on the edge of the circle to just a single. The Aussies don't like it though because it means there's light shining. Look at that. Oh, beauty. Still can't get it. Taken eight steps and mark and train. Oh, might have been done. Now that's a really hard spot. Some players need to know their role. Obviously, the. Yeah, and I don't want to sound. Shikhar, on the other hand, gets injured frequently, unfortunately for him. If he's like Glenn McGrath, who he remembers every venue. Here you go. Oh. This is, this is. Brilliant. We'll beat the fielder for four. The speed over the outfield was just sensational. Goes up to 49. It's 77 for one. There's a boundary of Hazel. Hazelwood. Just rocking back. Allowing the ball to come close to him. And played very, very close to the body. Near his back leg. Super shot. Batting of 29. And there he is. And the ever ready battery as well, isn't it? It's a 50 comes up for Rohit Sharma. What a performance. This bloke, his seasons just continue to roll. Probably no better timing than this right now. The heavyweight title match and he's opening the bout with this. Definitely missing. That still ended up getting out to him. Just eluding. Just eluding. In the stumps, makes the batsman play every time. And he's a. No, no, no. I think it's the first time also that he's getting a chance to. Wicket is also oh, gripping a bit. He must have seen. Uh, well done. The artistry and just the knack of playing spin of an Indian batsman. Saw the trajectory flat. Bit of width as well. Yeah, it was a width, I think, more than anything. Reasonably slow and flat. Just a nothing delivery. No problems at all for Rohit Sharma. Got an eye like a dead fish. Lines need to be wicket to wicket. And all time, big time. No, there's a good partnership. Score as much as they would have wanted to, to attempt Catch. to change all that. He's getting turned. The spinner goes through that spell. You try, it was not. Realize that when they send Mitchell Stark. He reacts. He's called for two, and we'll get it comfortably. So it was. You're absolutely right, Carl. To dominate him. In, the, in a classic case, turning. You can see both Rohit Sharma and Virat Kohli hitting more in the covers rather than straight. He's waiting for the short ball. 
almost preempting a loser to be shot. Roy Sharma. He's waiting for his ball, but it's the football that came short and was as per his expectation. Oh, I reckon it was short. Dragged it down. Easy pickings, and that's the sort of momentum breaker that can really damage you in a situation like this one here. <clears throat> Been building so much pressure. Got taken off the attack. And Labushain taken to the cleaner the last over. Oh, the seamer coming from the other. Absolutely. There are a few players out there who will always keep egging the others off. Coming back to ball. Oh. Oh. The kind of oh. he's punching it down the ground. Sensible batting. Twenty. So Stark, he needs to improve. He needs to improve, but that's not a good start. He's been so expensive, sliding onto the bat, but he's got width to use. On well, the extra pace. All Rohit Sharma is doing it is using the extra pace, and Stark is helping him by bowling wide. Look where, the, where it is. So far away. Easy. Easy for Rohit Sharma to play that square drive for a boundary. Seven. There again. And it took some brilliant fielding from Smith. But 300. That's gone. That deserved to go as well. It's a half tracker. And it's into the stand. Oh, you can't bowl it over there to the Chama. That's it. Just transferring the weight onto the back foot and bang it goes. Fabulous shot. Taking the aerial route because he's very confident of clearing the boundary line. It's four sixes. Catch. Oh, that's nice. Could change it. Oh, he's going to hit that one. His son, he got him out. A stark ball there, full quarter of overs. Oh, Not me, no. That's the biggest of the night. Top deck, nearly. You do not bowl short to this man. And not quite a ball delivery, does he? Look at that. LS, it's halfway down the pitch. And more, oh, it's gone into the crowd where nobody catches it either. Crowd are on their feet. Fielders in the deep don't matter to the modern-day batsmen anymore. They're capable of hitting. He's got the elbow up down the ground. At least two. Hazelwood. Good dive. Helps an average, but there are certain for now. Keeps the strike, moves to 97. He's gone for 10. And just out of reach. They'll be running it. Approaching this 100, he goes to 99. Rohit Sharma, he's on 99. The crowd are on their feet. And he runs it away, that'll be the 100. The brilliance of the man. He's 29th one day in a national 100. And he equals Coley with 800s against Australia. Well, it's been a magnificent innings. The man in form, recently winning the ICC One Day Player of the Year award for 2019, and he's begun 2020 also in splendid fashion. Boundaries eight fours and five sixes. When he gets a double hundred, he gets his hundred inside 30 overs. And he has to bat till the end. It's a pitch where it's a lot easier when the set batsman is carrying on the good work. Well, the 
fact that he goes on and he's got a couple of 200s, he knows how to knock. I wonder if Rohit knows he's got another 100 and a sparkling 100 at that. Well, we'll see the classic nature of this innings all around the park. That one, it looked like he didn't get it, went for six. That was definitely going for six. But just that ability through the offside, finding the gap, and then the onside, anything that's short has been put into the stands. So when Cummins and Stark... Excellent figures for him so far, just 26 stunts. Went. Now not much timing on it. It's interesting. When you can play shots like that every now and then, why would you try and do something different? Brilliant from Rohit Sharma. Jeez, out of nowhere he plays shots like those. He's bowled the same length he's bowled most day. Suddenly unfurls this. Yeah, he's been batting with a handbrake on, there's no doubt about it. Well, the handbrake's off there. That's a wonderful cricket shot, that. And bring up the 100 partnership in no better way. Flat and through the line. Is that, is that a rare off day today? But if you can. 114 not out. Rohit Sharma's at six sixes. This is a big six hitting round. I'm surprised Australia only hit two. That was that was truly in the spirit of Indo Australian friendship. That ball from Pinch. Yeah, ball slats. <laughs> Look at that, all around the ground, those sixes onside heavy. It gives you a great indication of just how they're generally fit. Just like that, nine runs of that over. I think they realise there's runs to be had of the fast bowlers, they won't. Second. Just picking up on that point, Kartik. Let's have a look. It's on. Don't think he's timed that at all. The cat is taken. The breakthrough is achieved. It's been a magnificent innings from Roy Sharma. But good reward for Adam Zampo. I think he's bowled magnificently as well. Yeah, he has. He's really bowled well when the onslaught was on. He's tried to keep the batsman in check. Beaten the batsman as well on quite a few occasions and finally reaping the rewards. The intention was to go over mid-wicket. But the slight slowness and the dryness just holding up, getting a leading edge and Mitchell Staff very safe under a high ball. Rohit Sharma goes for a magnificent 119. India 206 for two.